last time on Is It Trash? <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. Today I introduce to you the Elevate XL27 Curved Shaft. Dude, I am hitting corners, let's go! Yo, what's going on guys? Nasher here, back with another episode of Is It Trash? And in today's episode, we are testing out the, the Battle Mode Hockey 20 flex stick. So the guys over at Mode Hockey were kind enough to hook us up with four twigs. I told them I just needed one of them. They sent four in the mail, so we got a ton of different flexes and a ton of different patterns to test out. Basically, this company makes hockey sticks for kids and they're the lowest flex you can buy. This one here is a 20 flex. Are you kidding me? So I'm gonna be attempting to use these sticks in a shooting challenge versus my boy John. What? Uh, yo, John, you want to say what's up to the camera? Okay, then. All right, here's the guy behind the camera. This is my boy, John's plan. What's up? What's up? <laughs> this guy's an absolute legend at hockey. And today, we're going to be doing a few different challenges here on the rink. John, how long have you been playing hockey? <laughs> I think now... <laughs> About six months. <laughs> He's only been playing hockey six months, I promise. So this is what's going down in this video. We've got three separate challenges. I'm gonna be using the mode hockey sticks, which are extremely short and an extremely low flex. And John, He's only been playing hockey for six months. He's gonna be using his regular hockey stick. We're gonna face off to see who performs better. Challenge number one is going to be the three station shooting challenge. We're gonna have 10 pucks at each station. One's gonna be here, one's on that circle, one's on that circle. It's just gonna be very basic, who makes more pucks? Challenge number two is gonna be a game of pigs. So we have these pads available. We can move these to any spot on the rink and take shots at the net. You can call posts, you can call corners, you can call whatever you want. For the final challenge, we're gonna bring back a classic we haven't done this in a very long time. We're gonna be doing a crossbar challenge. 10 pucks right in the center. Whoever hits the most crossbars wins. You know what, I'm feeling a little bit generous today, John. I'm gonna give you the chance to pick which stick I use for each challenge. So we've got four different options here. Let's talk through each. All right, stick number one, this is the P2860 Flex. I think this one's the one that is gonna be most like a normal stick. As you can see, this is actually about the height I usually keep my sticks at. I think this is an intermediate. Stick number two, getting a little bit smaller, I think this is like a traditional junior stick. This is a 40 flex P92. So it's the blade I like, but obviously a little bit short. Now these two, this is where we get into trouble. Look at how short these are. I'm basically using a knee hockey stick when I'm using this one. This is a 20 flex, this is a 30 flex. So obviously I'm gonna be struggling with these. Look, I get down here, put a little whip on this thing. Dude, this thing's literally gonna snap right in half if I try even a hard shot. So it should be fun. Let's jump on in to the challenge. All right, so first up, we have the traditional shooting challenge. John is gonna give me one of the four sticks to use in this challenge. What are you thinking here, John? <laughs> Deep in thought. All right, we're going with the, uh, that's the 30 flex, right? Yeah. 30 flex, flex, big red. Challenge number one, station number one. We've got four corners on the net. We're gonna start bottom left, work our way around the top to the bottom right. Once you finish all, you can keep going around. We're gonna see how many pucks we can make. 10 pucks. I think before we get into this thing, though, we got one extra. Let's hit it with the slap shot. Low key, I'm just hoping I don't snap this on my first shot. Wish me luck. Are you kidding? I'm gonna start using this on the ice. You can see, we got a bit of a whip on this stick. Let's go bottom left to start, nice and easy. There we go, there's one. To the top left. Oh my gosh, are you kidding? Top right. John, you're dead, dude. I am actually a sniper with this thing. Let's go, bottom right. I'll let you be the judge, does that count? We'll count it. All right, it was like, it might have went slightly under, but we'll go bottom left. That one was good, top left. Don't think that one made it. That's off the pipe, put my all into this one. If it snaps, it snaps. Okay, that's not bad though, not bad at all. So we got a total of four, five, six in our first round. So that's round one. We'll get John out here for round two. There's no way he beats that though, let's go. Honestly, I was thinking I wasn't gonna be able to make anything with these short sticks, but I was out here sniping. John's, John's kind of rattled. 
he's getting warmed up now, and then we'll hop into this challenge. <laughs> All right, John's playing up next. He's a little rattled. Uh, we got 10 pucks. He's got to hit six. He also only has been playing hockey. Legitimately, it's it's probably only been like 10 months. All right, slap shots only. Hmm? Wait, what? <laughs> you know what, I took one warmy clapper, so I'm gonna give him one warmy clapper. Now we're actually starting. No redos, no resets. John is up. Here you go. <laughs> right in the middle of the net. <laughs> I have no idea what that was. Oh my gosh, what a cannon. Give me that top left. Yep. It's not a bad shot. Ew, so close. Oh! Yeah, you gotta save those for the crossbar challenge. I know. <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta make this one. You're in trouble if you don't make this one. All right, John, you wanna walk us through that uh, first performance there? Yeah, so I'm a righty, so I'm looking at the sun, so I couldn't really see. So unfortunately, I only made one, you know? I think there's room for improvement, for sure. I mean, you do have uh, sunglasses on. Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, station number two, we got a bit of a tougher angle here. We're gonna go 10 pucks. Also, me and John have decided, instead of having to go around the circle on these, it's just gonna be any corner. So my specialty is probably that top left, especially from this angle. So I'm gonna go top left, and we'll see how many we can hit. I kid you not, that was actually the first attempt. I'm gonna go bottom left. Yeah, that was good. Actually, that bottom left's not bad at all. It was determined that the puck completely crossed the call line and we never go. <laughs> That's a good goal. Let's go. Oh, I hit off the side of the net. Okay. All right, you know what? That's not bad. We got 10 from a tough, tough angle, 30 flex stick. I don't think John can beat that. Good luck. All right, what's your strat going into this one? You aim in bottom corner, top corner? Uh, I'm just gonna aim towards the net. Hope mm. something good happens. Once again, looking at the sun, so not really fair, but. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Did I say I was gonna aim at the net? <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen someone shoot that wide. <laughs> Ooh, that was a good shot. Bottom's pretty easy if you just slide it nice and slow. Oh. Dude, it's there. You just gotta, you got a couple of these for sure. <laughs> yep, I'll count that, I'll count that. There's one. Hockey sucks. <laughs> I'm gonna include that. <laughs> I love hockey. Yo, I know, I know I'm tripping John out here. I promise we're good buds. Great uh, buds. He can't confirm. I, I'm not a mean guy. I want him to do well. I really do. So let's get on into the third challenge. He's gonna bring this back. We're gonna have a close third one. Station number three. I'm currently sitting at nine points total amongst the rounds. John is at two. And for this final round, we're gonna add a little flair. These pucks are all worth double, so John has a good chance to come back. I feel like I need a little something to push you right now. So if you manage to come back and beat me in this round, I will buy you a new hockey stick. See how small that top right corner is? This one's going right in. That was literally right at the goalie's head. <laughs> no. There we go. So that's two points. I'm gonna say that was under. That was just entirely under. That one doesn't count. Still at two. That one's good. Four. I gotta get one in that top right corner. That's six. <laughs> I've never seen someone shoot that wide. Okay, six points for a total. I tried to go with some clappers to give John a chance. Six points, that means I'm sitting at 15. 15 to two, you have to make uh, Seven. <laughs> Seven out of the ten. All right, good luck. He's been hustling and waiting for this moment. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> hmm. I didn't know this was the uh, passing challenge. <laughs> 
Yeah, so he has a total of two misses that he can take here with the last seven pucks. Okay, there's your one miss. Here comes the hustle. <laughs> uh, that's official. The challenge has come to an end. He's got some pucks left. Yeah, here, I want you to rip one top corner just to, just to get you in the zone. Ew, that's filthy. That's honestly. <laughs> that's like a 10 point play. Yeah. Yeah, we'll just cut that up. Yep. Yeah. All right, so I took round one, but let's talk about the stick for a second. This isn't, is it trash? We're gonna determine if the battle mode sticks are trash. Honestly, I gotta say, I'm impressed with the quality of this thing, dude. It looks fresh, it feels nice. Stick handling, it feels good. And the fact that this is a 30 flex stick made for kids that I have not snapped on my clappers, that is actually really, really impressive. So I'm gonna take one more clapper right here, put my all into it, and see if I can snap this stick. Let's hit it with one big clapper, top right corner. Top right corner. Let's hit it with one big clapper. Top right corner. Let's hit it with one. <laughs> First try. Yeah, I'm just kidding. That was literally like 30 tries. 30 slap shots with a 30 flex and it didn't break. So obviously it's a little short for me, so it makes it tough to hit those shots, but my slap shot sucks in general. All right, let's move on into challenge number two. This time we've got a game of pig. We're gonna be able to move the pad wherever we want, call whatever corner we want, call posts, call like multi shots. So if I wanted to go like top left, top right, back to back, you can do whatever you want, get creative. Back at the stick selection phase, we've got three sticks remaining. Keep in mind, this could be the final round if I win it. Oh no. Yield 20 flex. <laughs> oh no. All right, John's up first setting the base shot here. We're playing P-I-G. What do you got for our first shot? Slot shot, top right. Okay, nice and easy. Nice and easy, you know, who can miss it? Right into the glove. First shot of the day, we're gonna add a little challenge. I think because I got a super like whippy stick, I'll be able to get it into those top corners nice and easy. So I'm gonna go top left, zero angle. <laughs> wow, what a snipe. Now we got John. He's on the opposite side because he's a righty. You gotta hit that top right corner. <laughs> he's shaking his head. Ooh. All right, that's a P for John. Moving on to shot number two. All right, we're going with a little double here. Two pucks, top left, then top right. Okay. No, I'm gonna go uh, top left. You're getting robbed, dude. <laughs> oh my. You know, John's obviously struggling with the outer shots. I'm gonna bring it in close here, see how, how you are on these. We're gonna go bottom right, top right. <laughs> Same where Nasher was. I'm just gonna try to put it top right, because I don't think he's gonna be able to lift it this close. I have a small stick, so. <laughs> Nipped it. That's the worst it could be. I'm gonna steal John's shot here. We're going in close, top right corner. You're lucky. All right, wherever this lands. I don't know why you threw it backwards instead of forward. <laughs> I really like these double challenges, so I'm gonna throw two down. We're gonna go bottom left, top left. What? <laughs> Let's go. Ew, there's one. Get that top left. Ew! <laughs> no way. No way, he actually hit it. Ew! <laughs> I'm gonna try a zero angle, but to the opposite corner. So I'm gonna go top right corner from the left side. <laughs> I just have no words. I'm hitting shots with this thing. All right, so we mirrored it on this side. He's right-handed, so we're going top left corner. That was an inch off the pipe and out. That is a P.I. And we move on in to potentially the final letter of the game. As you can see, we're at the uh, half court line. We're gonna go half court off the crossbar. Oh my gosh. 
two inches above the bar. All right, so we got the pad here. It looks like it's gonna be a zero angle. No, sauce kit. Wait, oh my, are you kidding me? I gotta try that. <laughs> All right, even and simple, right here, top right. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell John what we're doing, but we're gonna set the net up right here. And then we grab this, it's this on the wall here, and we are going around the bend into the sauce kit. I've been getting money, I've been getting yep. Let's go, first try, are you kidding? Oh, oh. You hate to see that. The door, the door's a little uneven too. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Well, we're still going, folks. All right, we got a sauce kit on the net. I'm thinking a little, little Alfredo here. Juicy sauce. Let's go. Dude, I am on fire right now. You better not get this one first try. John has already proclaimed that this is the end of his game. He had, he had some confidence going into the, the ring around the rosy. This one, not so much. We'll see what happens though. Since this could be the last shot of the day, I'm gonna get a cheeky angle. Don't hit me with this puck. <laughs> 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 And that, oh wait, no, 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 no. It's last letter, you get one more shot. You know the rebuttal. Off the side of the net and out. That, my friend, is the end of our game of pig and the end of this series. What a game. Hey, you played well. That was actually a really good effort. You made the trick shot. You made, what was it, zero angle. You had a couple nice shots, so. Overall, very solid game here in our game of horse. That will do it for this challenge. We still have the uh, crossbar challenge. You wanna just give it a go? Just one take? I'm down. Okay, crossbar challenge. Winner gets dinner? Sounds good to me. Okay, last one, let's get it. All right, since this one doesn't count, John is being kind enough to give me basically a normal stick. So this is the one that's 60 flex, and it literally is a perfect height for me. So I'm just gonna rock this one and see how many of these crossbars I can hit. All right, for our final one of the day, this is the crossbar challenge. I've got my 10 pucks lined up. John's 10 pucks are here. We're gonna do 10 pucks each and as many shots as you can hit off the crossbar. Everything counts. If it goes bar down, it counts. Bar out, it counts. As long as it hits the bar, it is a point. Most points wins. Let's go. Also, I am using actually a semi-normal stick and it feels super weird in my hands after using the, uh, the short runs. This is also the pink lemonade, as you can tell by the colors. Personally, my favorite finish. Oh, how do I hit the first one and I can't hit it again? There we go. That's three. Oh, that's as close to the corner as you can get it. Hit four. All right, four's not bad. 60 flex. It's a little whippy for me, but I did actually hit some corners. I was hitting my shots. We'll see if John can beat four. We got two slightly over the net, three slightly over the net. There's one. Oh! Okay, he can miss one more. Oh my gosh, give me another. Okay, so two pucks remain, you have to hit both of them. <laughs> Big dinner on the line, I'm talking steaks. Steaks? Big wow. steaks. Well, if I would've known it was steak, <laughs> all 10 of these would've hit. Oh my! There's one puck remaining, one to tie, and then we go to sudden death. Stakes are high. <laughs> that was actually solid. <laughs> All that build up <laughs> for a miss on the final shot. Hey, it was a good game though. He put up a good fight, and that is it for our shooting challenges. Now, I feel like we gotta try to snap one of these things. What do you say? Yeah. We're gonna try to snap the 20 flex, let's go. All right, so I know you guys have been watching this whole video and you want this thing to snap, at least I have. I wanted to just like rip a clapper and it snaps in half. This thing is so strong though. It has not broken by normal use. 
So now it is time to do a little durability test. I'm gonna just like take my foot, take my hand, bend this as far as it can go. You know what? Smart. Safety measures. Be careful with uh, flying fiberglass or whatever this is. We got some safety glasses on. Now we're safe. We got gloves as well. Dude, what? Are you kidding? Look at that bend. Oh. Oh my gosh. What in the world, dude? I have never seen that much flex on a stick. Kidding? Look at that bend. Okay, we were able to break it. I right, sorry about that, my main camera died, but we're on the iPhone now. We did break the battle mode stick after one of the most intense durability tests I think I've ever seen. So I do feel bad about breaking that one. The good news is we still have three very, very solid twigs and I'm gonna actually donate these. Uh, the Blue Jackets do all sorts of like equipment drives for people that need equipment or younger kids that are just getting into hockey. So I'll give all these sticks away to them so that they can enjoy these. But I gotta say, in general, the quality of these sticks is super, super nice. I was very impressed with the quality, with the durability, the shooting, the feel. Everything about this is nice. I gotta say, they look kind of dope as well. I would definitely rock these. I think this is a great stick, especially if you're just getting into hockey or if you're younger and need that lower flex stick so you can get a ton of whip on it. So big shout out to the guys over at Battle Mode. It is modehockey.com if you wanna check out their sticks. I'll put a link in the description below. But now it is time for the most important part of the video. Is it trash? So sticks, head to the trash can. I gotta say, it's, it's sad to do this. It's, it's really sad. This is trash. These, these are not. These are really solid twigs. Go and check them out. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is a trash. Be sure to hit the video with a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't. We got a ton of good content on the way. And that's it for this one. That's me. That's John. We're outie. Peace.